Welcome back, everyone, to yet another Jersey unboxing. I know this is a fan favorite type of video. I know you guys love Jersey unboxing videos. We did one on Christmas. We did one on Boxing Day right the day after. And that was our fourth and fifth Jersey unboxing we've ever done on this channel. Guess what? We're back with another one. Some good Boxing Day deals. And I got another one that I'm thinking I'm going to put out tomorrow. Hopefully, if it's not out tomorrow, it will be up soon. So I got this jersey. Another jersey, and I have one more coming in the mail, so lots of jerseys to be unboxed for you guys. I love doing these videos. These are my favorite videos to do. I cannot wait to show you guys this one because this is one that I've wanted for a while. I can't remember if I've talked about this too much on the channel. I think I've mentioned it a couple times that this is definitely one I want, one I need. It's definitely one of my favorite teams. Uh, we'll put that in there. So I'm excited to open this up and show you guys. I personally have not seen it. I had to open the box slightly just to make sure the order was right. But other than that, like I haven't opened it out of the original package that it's in. So I can't wait to see this. I haven't seen it in its entirety yet. I cannot wait to show you guys. So before we get started on that, you guys always know I do the three hints. What three hints am I going to give you today? So unlike my last two, I use this as a hint for the last two. I'm using this one. I think it's a pretty good first hint. So this team is blue. This team has a color that is blue for their logo, for their team colors, whatever you want to call it, which is one that you see the two I opened last or on Christmas and Boxing Day, the Gamecocks one and then the Debo Samuel one. Neither of those are blue. So my hints were those teams aren't blue. Now the hint is this team is blue. Second up, what should we go with? I'm going to stick with another one that we used last time. This team starts with a C. This team plays, I mean, yeah, this team plays in a city that starts with a C. Now I'm a big Chicago Bears fan. So that would make sense. And what are we going to go with? Let's go three. You already know it's an NFL team. Let's go three. The team's logo is an animal. We'll go with that. So plays in a city that starts with a C. Team logo is an animal. And they're, one of their main colors is blue. Let's see what it is. Let's open this up. Let's see what we got here. Use the scissors. You always got to be careful. Don't want to ruin the jersey, but got to get it open somehow. There we go. Should be able to just rip this off. I don't need to cut through the rest of it. Ripping the box apart a bit, but okay, here we go. I'll give you a little hint. There you go. You saw that. Don't need to show you guys anything more because you should pretty much already know what team this is. You know it's an NFL team. You know the color is blue. They play in a city that starts with this C. And their team logo is a mascot. It, 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 I don't even think that there's any other team that this could be. Other than the team that I already mentioned. The team that's on my hat right now. The Chicago Bears. But it's not the Chicago Bears because you know the Bears don't have a nice, vibrant blue jersey or the official color. The official color of this jersey is Carolina blue. And that just gives it away right there because we have a Carolina Panthers jersey. Oh my gosh, that is beautiful. <laughs> There's so much wrapping in this. Holy, I got to take a bunch of this off first let me clear this so we can actually take a good look at this jersey i'll put this back in the box but man oh man what do we have here look at that baby look at that just look at it same as the debo samuel one this is a nike limited although there's a lot more detail to be shown on this one as a nike limited than the Debo one, because the Debo one, other than the regular stitching that you'll have on the numbers and the regular NFL shield up here, there wasn't really anything with the sleeves or anything other than just the screen printed lines, and there wasn't no shoulder patch, which this one has a very, very nice Carolina Panther on there. As you may know, this is a, like, you know I'm a big, big, big Chicago Bears fan. Like, we just recently made the playoffs, so I'm so excited for that game, but I'm also a really big Carolina Panthers fan. It's just one of those scenarios where you fall in love with two teams. Obviously, I'm always going to cheer for the Bears. The Bears are always going to be my team. But I just also, I travel to South Carolina a lot. I pass their stadium all the time in North Carolina. I've been to one Panthers game before in my life. 
I went in 2018. It was like December the 8th, I think, against the Cleveland Browns. That was back in Baker Mayfield's rookie season. So it was a great game to watch there. The Panthers did lose, but I did get to see one of my favorite players, Cam Newton, play. And also Christian McCaffrey is on the back of this jersey. It was just a really good game. I think that was the last football game I've been to that was like a regular season game because since then I've only ever been to the a South Carolina spring game since then so it was it was really fun just to go I got to go with all my buddies we went on a road trip around Lake Erie so we went to a Pistons basketball game we went to a Michigan versus South Carolina uh you know I'm a big Gamecocks fan basketball game and Bernie on the channel is a big Michigan Wolverines fan so we went to go see our basketball teams play each other, which was great because that was the first time I had ever seen the Gamecocks play basketball before. And then also we went to Cleveland to go see the Browns play the Panthers. And then we also went to the Football Hall of Fame. So it was a packed week. So much fun. It was The only reason we got to go to the Hall of Fame was because our car broke down in Detroit. So we had to rent a car and our car was getting fixed in a shop in Detroit. So we had to stay an extra night and we got to go to the Football Hall of Fame out of it. So I was not complaining at all absolutely amazing but look at this jersey man here let me put it in front of them get the best look you can and take a look at the back here now i did get this jersey on sale but it is expensive like this almost cost me in canadian it was probably like 175 and that was on sale like originally this thing is 200 dollars before shipping before tax before duty and all that it is a pricey, pricey jersey. So I went all out for this one, and I'm satisfied. Like, the Carolina Blue, it, it is just something else. Like, it really, really looks nice, and I, I'm so pleased with this. I am really, really pleased with how this turns out. I love the sleeves. Like, here, I'll, I'm obviously going to do a montage at the end again for you guys like I have done in the past, but the sleeves, it's kind of like 3D here. Like, it kind of, like, comes out. Not necessarily 3D, but... You can tell it's different layers of fabric, which I really, really like. The Panther on here, I think that this is the best part. This is Nike Limited, so what would I have? My Bears one. Where's my Bears one? It's somewhere here. I was wearing it earlier today. I don't know what happened to it. But my Bears one is a game one, which means that everything is pretty much screen printed on. And by pretty much, I mean everything. The only thing screen printed on here is the keep pounding on the back of the neck. This is the first jersey I have that's NFL that actually has something on the back of the neck which i really really love they have that with the nhl adidas jerseys i got i think it says on the back of my leafs jersey like ready i ready something like that my blackhawks one does not the one back there does not say anything on the collar but i love it when team puts their slogan or something on the collar it's just an extra thing that i really really love got this in a large got the debo in a large so this is the exact same size but that looks super super nice it had to be the carolina blue it had to be so what am I going to do? I'll put this on. I want to try this on for you guys and just come and talk about it more. And then after I'll put it together, my montage. So let's cut to me wearing this amazing jersey right now. So there you have it. Check it out. Got the jersey on. Phenomenal. Fits great. Fits just like the Debo Samuel large limited jersey. These ones are amazing. I love the black color. Of course, I love like the chrome style finish on the NFL shield. I've always been a big fan of that ever since I switched to that. Just a really cool, like something new about the jersey. I should have put my Carolina Panthers hat on. I got a, I got a matching blue. You know what? I'm going to go get that hat. Give me a second. I'll be right back. Okay, so that seems more like it. I got the full Carolina blue going on. Love this color. I've been a huge fan of this color ever since the Panthers switched to this. They kind of switched the tone of their color because back in, what was it? The early like... 2000s early 2010s i'm pretty sure the light the carolina blue was a bit darker or a bit of a different shade of light blue but this one that they've now switched to now or the jerseys were also they had a kind of shiny texture to it this is just all like matte carolina blue i really really love this amazing jersey thank you so much for watching this video guys i really appreciate it for more jersey unboxings like i said i got one probably coming out tomorrow you definitely want to subscribe like the video comment anything about this jersey and check out this jersey montage check it out